mixed reviews on the movie First Reformed. I'm the anger guy. I'm going to tell you like it is. The director for the film First Reformed was Paul Schrader. He's also a screenwriter and film critic. Schrader wrote or co-wrote screenplays for four Martin Scorsese films. Taxi Driver, Ranging Bull, The Last Temptation of Christ, and Bringing Out the Dead. Paul has also directed 18 feature films, including his directorial debut crime drama, which was called Blue Collar, which was also co-written with his brother. The cast for the film first performed was Ethan Hawke as Reverend Toller, Amanda Seyfried as Mary, Cedric the Entertainer as Pastor Jeffers, Michael Gaston as Edward Balk, and Victoria Hill as Esther. The film is about a minister who is serving a small congregation while the desperateness from the world's problems, his own personal heartbreak, and his failing health is turning into total hopelessness for his everyday life. And with all these deep emotions working against him, a pregnant woman, Mary, played by Amanda Seyfried, who belongs to his congregation, asked Reverend Toller to talk with her husband. After talking with Mary's husband about his struggle to find life's truth for living, Reverend Toller is secretly agreeing with Mary's husband and finds himself even in a darker place than before. Ethan Hawke was casted perfect for this character. I give Ethan Hawke an A++ for acting in this film. I don't know what drives Ethan Hawke, but to me he always gives 100% into any character he portrays. For me, every scene in this film felt amazingly realistic. My rating for every main character in this film is A+. Then what is the reason that makes me angry about this film? I think it's because every tiny morsel for making a great film was used to create the movie First Reform. But I feel in my heart I can't give it a glowing review and recommend this film to have people pay money and go see purchase or rent this film. For me, the acting was superb throughout the entire film. It had a true and realistic feeling, but it was an extremely depressing film. Plus, I strongly disagree with some of the characters' choices that were portrayed in this film. The floating business was not at all a deal breaker for me. I just simply didn't understand the concept. Out of 10, I give this film a 5.8. All 5.8 points goes to the superb acting in this film. Thank you for watching and thank you for subscribing.